Hi there, it's Tito Rick Paisa with GuitarIngenuity.com. This is for you, Malio. Um, I know you had asked around, you had asked a question uh, around the strumming pattern for a specific song. I don't know the song, but I looked at the video that you linked over to the forum and I, I looked at it for a couple of minutes. So usually I would do a comprehensive tutorial, you know, with a breakdown of the song and everything. I don't have the time right now, but I wanted, since I promised you, I wanted to give you a couple of pointers with regard to the strumming pattern. So it's not 100% accurate. Again, I didn't have the time to look into it in more detail, but I think um, what I'm going to show you right now might help you to kind of get the basic framework of the strumming pattern. And um, you can practice that a little bit and then use that all throughout the whole song. And then once you, you know, get that into your fingers, um, you can then add a little bit of variation and, um, but you want to take it obviously one step at a time. So what I'm going to, what I thought is we're not going to worry about the chords and, and everything. If you need help with that, we can do that in another video. So we have just focused on the strumming right now. So he does something like this, right? something like that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to zoom you in and um, show you very slowly how you can use that strumming pattern with all different kinds of angles. So hopefully you will then figure out what you can do with your right hand in order to somewhat resemble uh, that same sound. And uh, for that purpose, I'm going to bring you in now. For the purposes of this video, let's just focus on one chord. Let's, lose that. let's use that A chord, for example. Um, that makes it a little bit easier because we want to focus on the strumming, really. So that's pretty much what, it, what he's doing all throughout, throughout the whole song with a little bit of variation here and there. Let's break that down now, okay? I'm going to do it very slowly. So for now, just watch my right hand, okay? I'm gonna do that a little slower now. Maybe we can do it even a little slower than that. And you see what he does here, what he often does here is as he comes in with a downstroke, he just mutes all the strings. So instead of strumming across the strings, you just hit the top part here and then immediately mute the strings with your palm. So slightly different angle now. All right, I hope that was helpful. If you need more help with the song, let me know. You can post a question in the forum or um, private message me. Um, and again, I apologize. It's not a full tutorial. I just don't have the time right now, but um, I thought since I promised you last night to look into it, I give you some, some starters to work with, okay? See you then, bye-bye.